movie theater security guard isn't that easy. There's some real life or death situations out there. But those days when I get to do a takedown, I savor those moments with my whole being. I lived a normal life once. I was like every other basic white girl out there, with my pumpkin spice latte in the fall, and my white sneakers. I had the perfect life that everyone wanted to have. But one day, all of that changed. I became a felon. On this particular day, I saw this here girl walking up. You could not only hear the packages crinkling in her pockets, you could see them. I guess she wasn't well aware that it is a felony in the state of Tennessee to bring extraneous packages into a movie theater. So I was ready for a takedown. I had done it before, because everyone does it. So I mean, why can't I? Because it's always okay to do something if everyone does it, right? Of course, like, that's just common sense. So, I brought in some snacks. I mean, like, only a few, not, not like a ton. But I brought in a few snacks to the theater, or tried to. And that is the day my whole life changed. I approached the girl. I asked her, Ma'am, are you holding extraneous packages in your pockets? She turned to me real soft, slow like, looked at me and said, No, sir. I said, Ma'am, I can see the packages clearly sticking out of your pockets. And then you know what? She turned and ran from me. So I pulled out my flashlight and went after her. Jumped on her, tackled her down to the ground, and grabbed my handcuffs out of my pack. Slapped them on her wrist while her face was pressed into the Sir, you need to calm down. For the whole year and 23 and a half hours that I spent in jail, I was thinking, if I had only had something that would help me go to the movie theater and bring my snacks without me getting caught, because that's a whole year that I couldn't do the things I love to do. I couldn't express my rights as a free American because I was no longer free. Here I was, face to the ground, holding this girl down. I start pulling packages out of her pockets. She has not only a bag of Swedish fish, but she has boxes of Reese's Pieces, Gummy Sharks, Nerds, Twizzlers. This girl is hacking. I asked her, do you know how much time this will give you in prison? said, no sir, I don't. I said, this much you're packing, you're going to be in a slammer for a year. She started crying and hollering, saying how unfair life was. I told her, well, you should have followed the law. I still have nightmares of that fateful day. That day when my life changed forever. The police asked me, do I have to do this? Okay. Let me try. The officer grabbed me and he threw me to the ground. And the worst part is, he took all of my snacks. I didn't even get to have one of my Swedish fish. 